Hey, good evening, Matt here, Map Investments. Um, so let me talk to you about. I guess I just go down the the list on the ones that I that I seen that are pretty good and might be popular that I haven't done uh, videos on. I know I did an, a video on XP. Um, I did a strangle on them today. So let's talk about. Uh, let's see. Let me see. Pick some popular ones here. Let's do let's do R E K R. Let's just go in order, I guess. So R E E K R has been showing up on my radar on the um, under ten dollar uh, stock list, and um, you can see here it had a big run up for three, and then a big sell off. Um, did did see some some I V in there today? So I basically did a put credit spread. Um, and I'll put it up in the other platform so you can see what I did. So, R E K R. Ivy rank here again six. Um, I don't think they had a lot of options. They're not a very big option stock. Uh, here was twenty four. Um, not really a lot of stuff in here going on. This is a small stock. Um, so what I did was I sold the seven fifty put. And bought the five call for protection and for margin relief and as peace of mind. So let's put it up here in the curve. Uh, put credit spread. Seven fifty five. So that's what I did here. I collected uh, eighty cents, seventy nine cents, pretty much where it's at right now. Eighty cents. Fifty six percent probability of success. Uh, I'm long 30 deltas and a little bit of theta working. Uh, max loss is 170, max profit is 80. And I'll try and manage this uh, at 50%, so $40. So hopefully it pops up and I can buy it back for my $40 profit. Remember, I do singles and doubles. That's why you may say, oh, he's only making $40. I'm only investing 170. It's only 170. Let me see what they're taking here in buying power. Uh, 250. 250 in buying power to try and make 40. But remember, I hit singles and doubles. So I have 70 orders today. Um, trying to put some stuff in February. So I do a lot of singles and doubles, and they add up when you do, you know, when you buy them back and you have an active day and you keep putting stuff on. It's it's a numbers game. So if I take off, let's say for example, twenty positions on a day, let's say on any given day I may take off five, ten, but they add up. You know, let's say you do ten, ten at forty is four hundred bucks. So and that's only one. That's 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 a smaller one. There's some that I do for eighty. There's some that I do for ninety. Some do for for more. So it varies, and, and whatever you do with the future trading. Um, as an engagement tool, these these are more of an engagement tool and hedging. I use them a lot to hedge, um, and I'll do another video on how to beta away your portfolio, which I think is very important. Uh, I would have to do it in a simulated account. I uh, wouldn't be doing it in this one here, um, but you can see right here. This is this is how you beta away position statement. You check here, you pick spy, you put spy, and then at the bottom it'll give you a, you, you'll be beta weighted. And you know how much exposure you have to the S&P. So if the S&P moves 10, and you know how many deltas you have beta weighted to the S&P, you know how much more or less your portfolio is going to move. So that was one trade on REKR. Uh, it's a small cap. You know, it's been trending. Um, I might do one on Sun W. I know a lot of people like Sun W. It was a similar trade, and I try and get some of the popular ones that. That people are are into and have been moving and maybe I don't have a video on. Thank you. Please like, subscribe, comment below, and I'll see you in the next video.